a problem plagues our society. Schools around the country lack means of teaching our ch children about the wonders that is our solar system. And to find out more about this terrible occurrence, I, field reporter John Chesteray, will go and find people off the streets and ask them questions on the subject. <laughs> Ma'am, ma'am, may I ask you a question or two? Certainly. All right, may I ask you, by what medium do you teach your students about the wonder that is outer space? Well, we have three chapters in our unit uh, covering the moon, the sun, and Earth. All right, all right, makes sense, makes sense. And how interactive would you say your lessons are? Well, at the end of the unit, we do a lab creating a scaled solar system using toothpicks and styrofoam. All right, perfect. And how well would you say your students are able to retain this knowledge? Well, I certainly can't guarantee anything after they finish the unit because there's no other time where we cover this curriculum. All right, thank you, ma'am, for your time. You there, boy, might ask you a few questions about our local spatial neighborhood. Sure. All right, what is the Kuiper's Belt? Uh, it's a kite that flies in the sun. Makes sense, makes sense. Now. How many meteors are in the asteroid belt? Uh, 42. Beautiful, beautiful. And now, final question. Where did Saturn get its rings? Santa. Perfect. You <laughs> sir! Can I ask you a few questions about our solar system? Yes, sir. All right, first question. What is the Oort cloud? I know this one. But it's not from space, I know that. It happens, get this, it happens right after I eat a whole bowl of chili from Chipotle. Okay, sir! Does Jupiter have rings? Most certainly not. Perfect, and now, how many stars are in our solar system? Now, I wanna say one, but that is clearly the wrong answer. It's either two or three, I'm not sure. You know what, I'm gonna go halfway, two and a half. Perfect, now sir, you did excellent, good job. But what if I told you you had it got every question wrong? Darn it! But what if I also told you that there was a way you could interactively learn about our solar system with the power of virtual reality? Ah! And that <laughs> is just what the group from Gretna plans to do. I don't know this guy! This is exactly what the group from Gretna High School IT Innovation Cup hopes to do. They want to create an interactive means to view the solar system to help, the edu to help educate the people of our society in ways that you can't get from a textbook by being able to travel to something almost like the surface of a planet and to, f and to view it and to look up details about specifically where you are. That is our goal. Thank you. This is Joan Chesseray signing off. Da 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 da